fine art insurance. What is it all about? For whom is it necessary and who can profit from it? The most simplest reason, the owner himself destroys the artwork. Shit happens, but the householder's comprehensive insurance doesn't pay. Same is worthwhile with your employees in your household. They can also destroy items. Your household comprehensive insurance doesn't pay, but the art insurance does. What's about your guests? Their liability insurance usually pays low costs and risks your friendship. So better buying an art insurance. Most of the claims happen during transport. The forwarder liability is limited, usually to 10 euros per kilogram. This is not sufficient to pay for an artwork. Extraordinary claims happen more often than expected. The simple question, please help me to get the painting in, can lead to severe damages. Classical insurance don't pay, fine art insurance does. Finally, the gallery delivers the painting to the client. And it didn't arrive the way expected. A classical case for finite insurance, depreciation is insured. And keep in mind, nothing beats fine art insurance.